The lights are back on for thousands of Michiganders after a brutal ice storm, but frozen pipes are creating a big mess for many. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jane Park in for Bill Harris. Thanks for joining us tonight. While the lights are back on, the mess from last weekend's ice storm is not over. Plumbers are working overtime tonight to make sure frozen pipes don't burst. NBC 25's Walter Kirk Randolph is in the newsroom with our top story tonight. Walter. Jane, plumbers tell me the calls keep coming in. They're responding to frozen pipe problems across mid-Michigan. Tonight, they're warning people to take some precautions before those pipes turn into an unwanted in-home sprinkler system. Kyle Dunbar is almost done cleaning up a big mess. Lost power, uh, the pipes froze up, and then uh, when they started to thaw out, I guess uh, one had burst. The damage, destroying ceiling tiles and equipment. When it thawed out, it turned into holy hell in here, and uh, my employee came in and said he about two or three inches of water rushed out at his feet. Dunbar's situation yeah. not unique as neighbors recover from last week's ice storm. A lot of people had the power outages, which is pretty unfortunate. If you didn't have a generator or a kerosene heater, you know, most, most likely had some frozen pipes. Plumbers say there are some precautions you can take. You can use, you know, old school, you can do a hair dryer, a hair dryer to unthaw them like that. You can use uh, kerosene heaters. Um, insulate your pipes. You can use heat tape. Obviously you won't do much with the heat tape if you're out of power, but at least insulating will help keep any... Usually when you have wind or air blowing over a pipe is what's going to cause that freeze and break right there. And when you do turn those pipes back on, plumbers say take it slow. Be careful turning it back on because you could have sprinklers in your house. Sprinklers Dunbar could live without. Just because it's the holidays, you know, water and ice and the weather doesn't take day off. Now, plumbers add for future protection, you can add insulation to attics, basements, and crawl spaces. Insulation will maintain higher temperatures in those areas. For more tips, head to our website, mynbcnews.com. In the newsroom, Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News. Jane? All right, thank you, Walter.